Hey everyone, Psychic here. Welcome back to We Are Racing. Tonight's cars joining us are Pip Squeak and Miss Muffet. Good luck to everyone. Kick back and enjoy the show. Let's go. Captain's Log 9, 10, 23. During our recent visit to the Comatel Raceway, we've noticed Footloose commanding a huge presence in what could only be described as dominance. But with great dominance comes great butt whooping. And a lot of butt whooping at that. But will the butt whipping continue, or will the dominance continue? We shall find out now. Starting us off tonight is Golden Snitch. He currently sits in third place in the point standings. Driving for Toxic Rock Diecast Racing in the 2021 Lotus Sports LS. Swinging in at 40.72 grams. Next up is Gypsy, our fourth place car in the point standings. Racing for Zelda Diecast Racing. In the 2015 Ford GT wing and at 38.45 grams. Next is Happy Chappy, our first place car. He is in the 1998 GT racer wing and at 51.59 grams and racing for Chris Hood. And our fourth car in this first heat of the night is Blue Star. Racing for Griffin Soul Diecast Racing in the 1984 Audi, weighing in at 36.39 grams. Let's get ready to race, folks. Is up front, we're going to have Golden Stitch on the inside, Gypsy on the out. In the back row, we'll have Happy Chappy on the inside, Blue Star on the out. Good luck to all involved. Our race looks like it's going to be Golden out to a little bit of a lead. Uh oh. And again, Gypsy takes over first place as Blue Star got crunched back there on that first straightaway. As we come down here to that final stretch, folks, it is going to be Gypsy Golden Happy. A quick look here from the UFO cam and see if we can see what happened to Blue Star. Right on that first straightaway, it was Happy Chappie that just went over to the side and just pushed him right over and made him flip over. Not a good start for Blue. It was Gypsy taking that one. Number two, as we are off and racing with this happy on the And no Gypsy gets put up on the side, but it looks like he's back on the track now. As you've still got happy out there doing nice lead here, but all four cars still in it coming down here to that widow maker run. It is going to be happy, golden Gypsy Blue. Well, we're at the midway point here for the first season of the night, folks, and it's Blue Star that really needs to get it going. As we are off and racing, it is going to be happy up to the He's trying to run Blue off, then he puts in a full block on everybody. Now he's out front. He is still really trying to push Blue off that track. Not for sure what's going on there, but he is using his weight to his advantage. That is for sure, folks. As we come down here to that Widowmaker run, it is going to be close, happy, holy cow, golden blue gypsy. We're going to check this one out again here, folks, as the old chap, Happy Chap, he's not racing very happy tonight. Look at him right there, knocking Blue around, puts in a full block on everybody. Come there. Now watch Blue start trying to make his way around him, and look what Happy does. Just does is he's best to throw his way right into him and block him. That allows Golden to come flying in there, coming down here into that slingshot there, line up one, two, three, and there comes Gypsy coming down here. Now watch this down here at the end as it is Happy taking the lead. And then right here at the end, it is Golden Snitch overtaking Blue for second place. Here we go, folks. It is going to be Happy to move on to the bonus round with the battle between Golden and Gypsy. It's going to be going on with him. As we are off and racing, it is Goldie out to the middle lead. Now she puts in that block on everybody. On that first set of turns, a lot of cars like to do that. Oh, looky there. You've got Happy moving into second place. Now, as we come down here into that Widowmaker run, we've got a nice run going on here. It's Golden Happy Gypsy Blue. We'll watch this one again as there was a nice race here. We'll check this out from the UFO cam. Nice and tight racing here. A little bit of rubbing. Rubbing's racing. Coming down that first straightaway and then the block right there by Golden. And lucky there. Happy moving into for second place. He tries to take first and a crafty move there by Golden. They're putting in that block right there as they come down here to the end. Watch this late charge by Gypsy to take over third place. So happy Chappy and Golden will be moving on to the bonus rounds this week and Gypsy will be back again next week. Blue Star is out of here. She made it through one race and wasn't able to make it this time, folks. That's all right. Let's get ready for race number two or heat number two of the night. Starting us off in our second heat of the night is a car that's got everyone talking. It is Footloose. For racing for Mo Howard Jr. in the 1997 Firebird weighing in at 35.78 grams. Next up is a newcomer, Miss Muffet. The 1970 Plymouth Barracuda, weighing 35.29 grams. 
Up next is our second new car to join us. It is Pipsqueak. Pipsqueak. Sidekick Sandy, what are you thinking? This looks like a mean car, not a little Pipsqueak. But Sidekick Sandy says it's Pipsqueak. We're going with Pipsqueak. It will be racing for Jerry Rodriguez from Puffs Racing in the 1997 Callaway, weighing in at 36.28 grams. Setting in sixth place in the point standing is Tornado. He'll be racing for Chris Holyfield in the 2014 Velotica, weighing in at 36.46 grams. Starting us off in our second heat of the night, up front we're going to have Footloose on the inside, Miss Muffin on the out. In the back row, we have Pipsqueak on the inside, Tornado on the out. We are racing. This is not too good way to eat. It's a block right there on that first set of turns. That seems to be the popular thing to do to here tonight. As he's still got it going on down here into that sneak shot. Uh oh, looky there, you got Pipsqueak gets held up here on that drift for straight. It is going to be Footloose, Muffet, Tornado. It was Footloose taking lap number one here in our second heat of the night as we get ready for lap number two. We are off and racing. Let's see if she can hold on to it, folks. As we're going to stick with the old UFO cam here for a minute as K Fry decided to take a nap there. Our cameraman there in Crispy Corner who come down here to that final stretch. It is going to be Muffet, Tornado, and uh oh, Pipsqueak and Footloose get tangled up and don't make it across the finish line. Well, I take back what I said about Pipsqueak is he is not looking big and bad right now. He's yet to cross the finish line. We are off and racing. This week is out front. Bet can he hold it? No, uh, yeah, can't he even cross the finish line? As we come down here to that drifter straight down into the same shot, they're all lined up here. Looky here, folks. We may have all four finishing. It is going to be Pips Week, Tornado, Footloose, and Muffet. To my surprise, folks, Miss Muffet is in the lead. But this is still anybody's competition as we are off and racing. They've got a little rubbing his racing going on up there once again. That first race, they're kind of binging and banging all over the place here tonight. As Footloose is out front. Looks like the oh, awful car is still there. Miss Muffet that we were just talking about is falling way behind. Coming down here to the end is going to be Footloose, Tornado, Pipsqueak, Muffet. Nice bit of racing we had going on there, folks. So this is going to be Footloose and Tornado moving on to the bonus round this week. Miss Muffet, shockingly, will come back next week. She had first place there for the longest time until she took last place in that final race. And Pimpsqueak, that surprised me. I thought he'd do better, but he is out of here. You're looking at Boondocks from MQH Racing, our Season 1 Custom Carnage Champion and first member of our Hall of Fame. As we get ready to move on to our bonus rounds this week, food for thought. Why did the race car go to therapy? Well, because he had too many lapses. Alright, let's move on. Up front, we got Happy Chappie on the inside, Golden Stitch on the out. In the back row, we got Footloose on the inside, Tornado on the out, as we are ready for some bonus racing action. We are racing this Happy Chappie on the inside, and then walk right there for the front of the turns. And looky there, you got Golden trying to make his way around him, but that allows Footloose to make the move right there in Armageddon Corner to take over first place. He's got a big lead coming down here to Widow Maker Run, folks. It is going to be Footloose, Happy, Golden Tornado. This is why we bring you bonus racing action, folks, as it is the best of the best for the week going at it, and they really went out of here in this first race. Looky there, you've got Happy putting in the block on everybody, and he's really trying to hold off Golden, and that just opens up the door for that dynamic footloose to come flying through there, taking over that lead. And then he comes down here into that drifter straight, they start to drift a little bit. Golden and Tornado battles it out as Tornado ends up taking the lead and taking over third place, and here comes Happy taking it back. It was Footloose taking a very exciting lap number one, folks, as we get ready for lap number two. We are racing! It is Footloose out front here, as you got Happy back there battling it out there with Golden. And look at Footloose, has got off to a huge lead here, folks, as we come down here in the Widowmaker run. It is going to be Footloose, here it comes, Happy! Holy cow, what a charge that was! We're going to check this out on the old UFO cam, folks, as I have no idea who took second place. See if we can catch it here on the UFO cam. And look at that huge lead put on by Footloose. I tell you what, when he's out front, he's almost impossible to catch, folks. Coming down here into that Widowmaker run. Let's check this out. You got to check it out. Up here at your very top left hand, you're going to see it was Golden Snitch just edging out. Happy there for second place. Followed up by Tornado with a fourth place finish in our bonus lap. It was Footloose taking the first two laps here in our bonus racing action. Let's see if he can make it three in a row. He knows last 
Well, it wasn't in the bonus, unfortunately. Look at him. He's out right here again. Here we go down here to that Drifter Street. He's still got a nice lead. Looks it's going to be hard for him to catch him. Down to that final run we go. It is going to be Footloose. Tornado Gold Happy. It's been Footloose running Footloose and Fancy Free here in the bonus rounds, folks. As we get ready for our last race of the night, we are off in race. And you've got Golden Happy there battling it out for second place. It looks like it's going to be Happy taking over that second place. Line. Coming down here into that wood. It'll make a run, folks. It's going to be Tornado Happy Golden Footloose. And here's how our bonus points shook out tonight as it was put loose with 16, Tornado with 10, Happy with 9, and Golden with 9. We almost had all four cars pick up double digit bonus points here tonight. But now it is time to find out who tonight's big winner is. Footloose is tonight's big winner. As he seems to be getting stronger and stronger each week. In week number two, he really put on a good performance, but just did not make it. Now, this week, he is our big winner. Let's look at this point. For the night, it was Footloose with 28. Happy Chappie with 24. Golden with 23. Tornado with 21. Gypsy with 10. Miss Muppet with 10. Pipsqueak is out of here with 7. And Blue Star is out of here with his 4. Now, let's see how this season point standing set. There we go, folks. It is Happy Chappie with 80, Footloose with 75, Goldie with 68. They seem to be the three most dominant cars so far in this early season. You got Gypsy holding on tight. Nice and steady with 45, Tornado with 37, Disturbia with 22 is out. Miss Muppet with 18, and Blue Stars out with 11. As always, we'd like to thank you all for joining us and hope you had a good time here with us tonight. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and leave us a comment please as it definitely helps out the channel we'd also like to thank each and every one you see here on the screen for making this channel possible along with you you all make this channel possible till next time race fans happy racing